last piece. Everyone makes a guac. Okay. So we got pre-made avocado and diced, and diced onions. Jake, say hi to the camera. What's up, everybody? <laughs> All right. So I'm just gonna show you how to quickly cut a avocado or avocado, whatever one you would like to prefer to say. Split it open. This is the careful part. Pit, knife, knife, pit. Go, twist. Fun fact of the day, France banned avocados because it became too dangerous because people were cutting their hands off. So what we're doing is we're taking our knife, we're going through it, pushing, making a nice little diced pieces. Same with the other side. Take your spoon, scoop it out, not onto the floor. Did you get there? No. Okay. Okay. So I put about four avocados in here and half a red onion. Okay. So you can do however much you want to. Depends on how much I like my onion. Line. So we'll take a whole line. Juice it. Okay, cool. And we'll take some take our salt. Put it in there. Our last piece that we need is a little cilantro. So we want we want to see the leaves. The stems are good too. And just however much you want. Cilantro is a really good, fresh taste of things. It comes up in a lot of you know, Mexican dishes, it's nice, and it's key ingredient to guacamole. All right, so what we're gonna do is, it's nice and chopped up. Same thing, watching our fingers, and kind of pinch it together. If you wanna be fun, so finishing up. Our guac. All right. If you have a potato masher to make mashed potatoes or mashed sweet potatoes or anything like that, it works a lot better than a fork. But all I have is a fork, so that's what I'm gonna do. All I'm doing is just mixing, really smashing those avocados into the side. And I like mine a little bit more chunky than most. So avocados that are in there, you know. If you want to add a little heat, you can always put in a jalapeno. And then, if you don't want to add heat, don't do that. If you really want to add heat, find yourself a nice scotch bonnet. Boom. We are done with our avocado. Nice little mix, do a little taste test. Pretty good. Have a good one.